Hello, my name is Claudio and welcome to another Italian tutorial. In particular, welcome to a rather non-conventional video on how to pronounce the Italian R or how to trill your tongue, how to roll your R's. As many people know, in Italian, the R sound is very different from the English sound. In fact, the R sound in Italian sounds a little bit like and some people can't do it. <laughs> as simple as that. Now, if you want to learn how to do it, there are two ways. The way I've learned it and the way every single native speaker across the world has learned it and the way most non-native speakers tend to learn it. Now, the first way is my favorite and I recommend you choose this path. It involves repetition, repetition and also repetition. Basically, what you do is you listen to the R sound being pronounced and you try and repeat. You will fail and you will try again and you will try again and one day you'll succeed. Now, it may appear as a very ignorant way of going about things. Well, the fact is this is the only way that has worked for everybody who could physically make that sound. Anyway, what I recommend you do is do both. Try and repeat, listen and try and repeat and also do some exercise that can help you stimulate and activate the right muscles in your mouth to make your life easier. So with this video I'm going to try and help you regardless of what method you choose. So if you choose to go with the first one, so if you're on YouTube now, scroll all the way up until you see the link of this page. So it should be something like HTTP, whatever, www.youtube.com, slash, etc, etc. And what you can do is, you can plug in the word repeat instead of YouTube. I'm sorry, instead of tube. So you would end up with something like www.urepeat.com slash and exactly the same link. Then a new page should open up of a new website that basically has a built-in playback function that allows you to repeat one video non-stop. And also you can set the limits and have the video play only one single bit. And at the end of this video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pronounce the R sound and roll it for as long as I can so that if you want, you can play back and you can practice, practice and, you know, however long it takes, whatever it takes. So one minute, five minutes, ten minutes, you just hear it, hear it, hear it, listen, tune in, listen and practice, try and repeat. And one day you'll succeed. If you choose the other path, then there are so many people on YouTube already teaching you exercises so I'm not gonna come up with new ones because I don't even know if they would work. In fact I'm really skeptical when it comes to teaching the R sound to a non-native speaker uh, giving precise directions because I think it's pretty hard. So I was curious and I watched a lot of videos where native speakers or people who have learned it teach other people how to learn it and I don't think there's any great video out there but there's a few good ones. Now here you have a selection of my favorites what I think are the best videos on YouTube right now. All these links are in the description if you need them. The first link is basically a video where a guy is teaching you the R sound with a very professional approach. He's a vocalist or a singer and he basically trains people. This video is particularly good if you're not an English native speaker. This is because his English is very, very clean and easy to understand. If you're an English native speaker, I recommend you watch the second one instead. Now, the second one was made by a Chinese lady. I think she is, um, she speaks Mandarin and her English is brilliant. She goes through a lot of drills and exercises to help you stimulate the right muscles and I think she makes very interesting points. So I think this video will really help anybody who is trying to understand how to pronounce the R sound in Italian. The third 
link is a video made by a girl named Rachel. And Rachel makes the point that your tongue has to vibrate. Some people say that your tongue has to touch the top of your mouth or it has to be in a particular position. Now the whole point of making the R sound is that the tongue has to vibrate. Okay. And again, I really recommend you watch the second video because, you know, she explains it in a way that couldn't be explained better. The fourth one is an interesting video. Interesting meaning almost useless, but interesting if you want to know about the R sound. Now, it's a, it's a video made by a linguist and it talks about pronouncing the R sound in Italian and Spanish from a linguist's perspective. So it's nice to, you know, it's a bit of a, it gives you an overview and it says a lot of interesting things and information about the R and about the way it's pronounced. I don't know how useful it is in terms of actually learning it. But um, as you can see, you have a selection here of very useful videos. So I'm just going to go ahead and pronounce the R sound now and I'll see you in the next video. Good luck. <laughs> Wow, that was tough.